This is in the front seat. Welcome back to another episode of The Burn, everybody! Welcome to episode three. Today, we are gonna be talking about zombies, some of that Walking Dead BS, you know? So the question today is, what would you do on the first week of the zombie apocalypse? Like, what's what's your plan? Because most people will die within the first week because they're like, oh shit, zombies are eating people. Like, what the fuck are we doing? Or they'll be like, what is a zombie? And then they'll just like start dying and shit. Like, what would you guys do? Okay, so for the first like 24 to 48 hours, since this is real life, I would do everything I could to make sure like it's an actual zombie apocalypse. Like that's what I would be spending my time doing, like figuring out what is really going on. You know what I'm saying? I feel no, like no, you're gonna die that way. Yeah. No, 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 in real life, it doesn't seem like a zombie apocalypse is like, you know, an actual thing that could happen to me, like within the next 20 or so years. So if actually that happened, I would spend like 24 hours like reading as much material as I can, like of current news all around the world, make sure it's uh, an actual like apocalypse, yeah. make sure it's not just like some random Bath ish salts. going on, or yeah, <laughs> some drug or something, like right. really make sure it's a zombie apocalypse and then hit the ground running. And then I would like find like you or like people I know, get a big group together. I think the bet, and, and then for the first week, it would definitely be obviously finding shelter, maybe trying to see, I, obviously I wouldn't try to move out anywhere, I'd probably stay local here in town, for mm -hmm. sure. I wouldn't attempt anything like that, because you don't know what's going on outside, uh, or like outside of this town, like literally anything could be happening. So I try to hit up like a Walmart or Costco, I feel like that would be a very popular move though, so yeah. I would try to, to at least gather resources from one of those stores at the very least, right? Maybe not live there or bunk there but I, I i first things first i'm finding a big group like Sorry. like that's what you have to do you have to find a big group um i mean not too big though because then no. you run into like the crazy human thing because <laughs> humans true. get all fucking I, it would obviously be people i know right 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 like firsthand yeah too. but like before like humans start like turning on each other and killing each other i bet it'll be like a month or like two weeks when that's like, people, true when like people start really getting hungry and stuff like that that's true very true and if there is an empty store somewhere Try to try to barricade that up, yeah. right? Yeah. Like, because that's all at the time. It's it's limited supplies, but it's also unlimited at the same time. Yeah, yeah. I feel like, store like bar that. barricading a store would be like on like week three or two. Or you like think some... you don't think it'd be the first week? Oh, no, 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 no. Because <laughs> everyone's gonna be doing that. Like, yeah. I feel like there's gonna be a mass amount of people, and that's when there's gonna be like hordes of zombies. Like the first week, you go to Costco to try and like take over Costco. Yeah. There's a million fucking people there, and then there's a million fucking zombies there. Yeah, yeah, I think that's definitely like adds into my my whole idea because my my thing is like most people are gonna be like, oh yeah, I'm gonna go to like this giant store and like collect supplies and stuff like that. But like, yeah, people, everybody's gonna do that. Everybody's gonna be out in the road. People are dying on right. the road and stuff like that. You're Me, right. like, I think my whole like plan would just be like observing what's going on outside of my like house door so because right. i live in an apartment complex so i would just like look through the people yeah that's also part of my thing like the first one to two days is like checking everything out like making sure yeah yeah because like i'm not going hungry now like yeah. i have food at yeah. my house to eat yeah. but like i personally like i will see if my neighbors will leave like right. the ones that live in front of me because if they leave, there's a high like chance that they're not coming back. Like, if they're one of the people that are like, oh yeah, let's go to like this pharmacy because we're gonna need drugs and shit, and we're gonna try to survive this shit. Like, they're they're idiots and they're gonna die. And then I'm just gonna take the liberty to break into their house and steal all of the supplies that they have because they're yeah. not coming back for it. Good there point. You go. Yeah, yeah. And uh, yeah, same with you. Like, eventually, I would want to like round up my people and stuff yeah. like that, but. I would probably not want my like group to be bigger than ten people. Yeah, and you're right. You should. It's smart to stay put for the first little bit. Too. Yeah, yeah. Because not, it's, try not to move anywhere. It's just too dangerous. Like you, yeah. if you watch like movies like World War Z or yeah. uh, like Dawn of the Dead, like it's be the yeah. people start dying because they yeah. like hit the road. You know. Yeah, I was gonna bring up Dawn of the Dead actually yeah. <laughs> because like that's the one with the mall scene, right? Where they're yeah, all yeah, trapped. Yeah. 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 Yep. So, Why would you and, like, trap yourself? Yeah, and then like, oh my god, yeah. yeah. What's your uh, What's your plan, Tony? My plan, um, I'm a family man, and I have the liberty of my parents live like two blocks away from where I live, and so I would just go to my dad's house, and they have a shit ton of food, and they have guns, which I think weapons is a Ooh. necessity. Yeah, yeah. Oh, for Zombie sure. Zombie apocalypse. And also, 
there's, I don't want to be around a shit ton of people. So within the first 24 hours, if I like knew like, oh, there's like zombies, I would go to my parents' house. And then, well, yeah. Does like, your, okay, so does your guys' plan change if, well, yeah, it's like, you have if to you be guys, ready if to you change. Know. Like, what if you knew the zombie apocalypse was going to happen on a specific day? Oh, yeah. Then like, you, you, like, like, you just got an anonymous tip and you believed it. And I believed it. However much time, yeah, I would, I, I would just use that to prepare. Yeah, I would go to, I would go buy a shit ton of food. I wouldn't, have, wouldn't be able to steal it. Right. Because no one True. else knows at this point. True. But that's fine. Whatever. I don't give a shit. It's not like I'll just go get a credit card, to be honest. Yeah. That day. And then go spend, like, max out my credit card and there then just go. go. Just one? I would I probably stop that at least a couple of the apocalypse hits, then Yeah, like, my credit matter. score is back to normal. <laughs> yeah, like, uh, you could spend, like, hypothetically, if you have, like, three days, okay, ahead of time. Right. Like, you could spend that first day just signing up for as many credit cards as you can. And then just go into stores and pick up all the water and all the food and all the guns yeah. that you can. Like, yeah. Like, you could probably talk to, like, a gun shop owner and be like, hey, what is the fastest, like, no. like weapon I can Here's get? the real question, though. No, you can't. Because if, unless you have um, a license to buy a gun, you can't buy a gun. You can go to a sporting goods store. <laughs> um, you don't. You don't have to have. You just have to pass a background check. Oh yeah. To get a to get a gun, and as long as you're not like a felon or have any misdemeanors, and you're over the age of 18, you'll be fine. You can go to any sporting goods store um, and do that. But my question was, America. what so? What do you think the government would do in the situation of because they probably advise us to evacuate? What if they send officials house to house? What are you are you gonna? You're I mean, try to oh, avoid no. that. Oh okay. no! Okay, the it? Walking Dead. Okay, so, he, so <laughs> I haven't seen no, not you fear. Right, no. So this is my whole thing about like the military. I think that's the most accurate way it's gonna okay. do it. Yeah. So here's my whole thing about the military. I think that if the military, like hypothetically, if a zombie apocalypse like started, right. and it started around this area, they would probably quarantine the area and kill every single like living thing in the area just so like the disease won't spread. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Like they would do everything in their power to just like to nullify this because right. that's like a world breaking like disease that could like, right, spread. Right. Yeah, and like we get our like I feel like I mean we just bombed, you know, a fucking country. So we're absolutely just gonna bomb ourselves. Like yeah, if yeah, that yeah, happens. Yeah, yeah. Like And like I don't know. I just feel like Yeah. The they'll per they'll pretty much outweigh our lives. They'll just yeah. be like six like six thousand people dead doesn't compare to like the whole world, you know. Like right. this, this is yeah. a, such a small number, and then like it'll be devastating. But like, and I at that's why I'm gonna try to get out. Yeah, <laughs> and then we would yeah. Back. Okay. eventually. Okay. Yeah. Um, did you finish your idea? I'm sorry. I think I no, it's okay. Well. We're all just pitching ideas. I like it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. <laughs> but um, but that's just yeah. I would go to my dad's house, and then eventually um. I, I wouldn't want, I like your idea of like not going too far out of town. Like, I don't want to like yeah, travel anywhere. Yeah, like there's, there's no that reason far. to go anywhere around yeah. here that like, because all, all, all surrounding Vancouver is just like cities. Yeah. Well, not if you go out past like by like Lackmas, you go out that way. Oh, uh, yeah. Then it's for, like towards then, like large mountains. Yeah, yeah, but that's like you have to cut through like canvas or whatever, yeah. I mean, yeah, but I would risk out. Going you would risk there. going through Camus? No, not through Camus. You go the back ways. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, I would go all the back ways. Would you guys try to go to, like, the coast or something? By water? No. Ocean, no, maybe? because no? I would want to be by water, but why would I want to be by the ocean? I can't even utilize the ocean. It's salt water. Yeah, if anything, I would start moving towards north. I just feel like zombies. Oh, like I would go north. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, the colder the better. The zombies. I just, probably I just feel like zombies yeah. aren't attracted to the ocean or something. Yeah, that just means I don't know. Aren't like, attracted. You know what I'm saying? Well, like maybe like, like the don't... noise, like the constant noise. Like, because zombies are like more attracted to like noises. Yeah, but it's like, have you sounds. seen a quiet place? Yes. Oh so my god. So by the river, I mean, it's like a constant noise. So yeah. they become accustomed to it. All right, so I hear it. Here's another question that I have for you guys. What do you guys value more in a zombie apocalypse? Like, say we're three months in, like everybody that's supposed to survive, survive. And you guys are just like, all right, we have these three things to focus on. Food, water, or weapons. Like what, and like, say you already have a shelter and stuff like that, that is pretty solid. What do you guys value more? Well, their grills taught me anything. Uh, water is more important than food because you can yeah. go longer without food than you can without water. Mm -hmm. So I would value that a little bit over food. But in terms of like weapon, like you have all the food and water in the world, but you don't have something to defend yourself yeah. with. You're dead within. Yeah, yeah. 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 So yeah, if shelter is good though, 
I don't know. I would always, I would always make sure I would have a weapon on me though. So I, th I think weapon, I, that would be the first. I don't know. I would maybe surprise. I would, I would say weapon in a zombie apocalypse. Yeah. Like for different apocalypse. You're three months in, so like hypothetically. Oh, we're three we're, months in. Yeah. And like, oh, like our weapon breaks. Like. Oh yeah. Like our weapon's broken. We're out of food and we're out of water. What would you go out and get first? Yeah. Kind of type thing, almost like if we were. We're out of engineering. all three right now. We're out of all three, and we need to go get one. The our first thing good. you have to get in a zombie apocalypse is a weapon, because yeah. if you try and go yeah, and I get food say. somewhere, right. and there's zombies there, you're dead. It doesn't fucking matter. Yeah. Yeah, but then you have like melee weapons that don't like require like bullets or anything like that. True. Well, we do have those. I mean, well, you'd, you'd oh, like you're three months and you'd them. eventually find them, and okay. they won't like break. True, anything. over the three okay, months okay. that would be over. Then yeah, I would yeah. say, <sighs> like eventually, like you would have like level one stuff because right. you have nothing else. Okay, then I would say supplies then. Supplies, like well, food, yeah. or water, food or like water. Water, like, for first. water then. Yeah, water. Like absolutely, water, yeah. yeah. It'd have to be water. I think it, for Between me. Between those two, it's always water if you're yeah. out of both. Yeah, I think it just depends on the situation, and I think it depends on like who I have with me and what they value yeah. more. Because I'm like. I'm not the person that will just like make the decision like we will get this one thing. I'd probably talk with it like with my people and depending yeah. on like what's going on because like there's nothing I don't want more than like everybody to turn on each other. Like, yeah. If if that like were to happen, it just would make things worse. Like I wouldn't yeah. even have to worry about guns, food, or water anymore. I'm worried about like my people trying to kill each other and be like, no, like yeah. I should eat more because I do this and that. Like no, like we're trying to stay equal out here. You know. We're uh, we're gonna do rock paper scissors. And uh, the winner will just do the outro and like do the whole like favorite and subscribe thing. All right. All right. One, two, three, go. Okay. Right. Wait, wait, hold on, guys. <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, well, we got the rhythm now. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, it's one, one. Okay. okay. That's why it's my show. Yo, and that's the show. If you guys liked the burn, watch the burn. Like the burn. If you feel like it, leave us a like. Just kidding. Do whatever you want. Or subscribe. Just kidding. If you want. <laughs> so uh, at this time, no, please subscribe and like. If you want. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Don't listen. Uh, to I don't. I don't want, definitely subscribe. Go ahead. I just, if you want to, go ahead. I don't. I don't want to force anybody to, to do anything. Just watch my videos if you want to. Like, support me if you want to. I think that's more genuine to me. Anyways, thank you for watching. Uh, tune in the next time. We're about to release so much content. I'm going to do this every week. I'm going to try to do a vlog every other week. Yo, vlogging is draining. It can be. It really, really can be. But you know what? Thank you, you for supporting. Uh, I'm going to let these guys talk about whatever they want. Um, I don't make any videos lately, but I want to, so check out my channel. Yeah, I might be releasing some videos on this channel coming up, too. Uh, are you never going to talk about your podcast? He does a podcast. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. You, <laughs> really like, like, in I'm like, I just want to plug, plug this shit in, man. NFL Draft, keep me busy. You can check it out in the description below. <laughs> All right, peace out.